Now I can show you a new feature in SilverFX2, and that's the History Browser. When I click on this icon to show the History Browser, the presets are replaced by a history list of everything that happened, uh, every adjustment that you made, every click that you did within the, the uh, software. So in this case, all I've been doing is adding presets, but you'll see if I make adjustments to any of the, the adjustment tools or apply a color filter, whatever I'm, it might be, it lists it here. And if I want to go back to any step, all I have to do is click on it, and it takes me back to that step. Notice how the other steps downstream get grayed out. Now, if I don't do anything, I can just go back to where I was or go back to the very end. But let's say I start here and then I make another adjustment. So let me just change the contrast slider, whatever. Notice all of the other steps downstream disappeared and they were replaced by whatever adjustment I just made. So keep that in mind. The history browser can be used in that way just as a way of undoing things or going back and seeing things. But the other cool thing about the history browser is that when you use it with the preview modes in the comparison tools, it'll show, give you a way of comparing different image states that you may have had. So let me start by going into split preview mode. And notice what happens to the history browser. I get a little arrow here that allows me to set the before state of the image to whatever step that I wanted, even the color image. So I'm going to just leave it as the default neutral. And then where I click, it'll show me on the right-hand side the edited state. So I can compare any two states. If I want to just compare between where I was before and where I was after, all I have to do is drag this slider to set the before and then click the step that I want to compare it against. This works in, in split preview mode. It works in side-by-side -side preview mode. and it also works in single image preview mode but to get it to do that I have to click the compare button and then it's gonna to toggle between my states